and I'll name it as public static void get save or I'll name it as save screen shot and then I will close my box and in here I will take this component as component itself and after that I will take a string string and I will name its na variable name as file name and after that I will write throws exception so what I have done is I have made a second method called save screenshot and I have taken three variable a component variable a string variable and I will throw its exception now in the main method here I will write the code for converting this image into PNG so write buffered image and I will name my image as ing is equal to I will copy this variable get screenshot this function which I have made earlier and I will paste it here and in the bracket I will write component sorry not this component this component I have to write with a small c and I will close this box and what I have done is I have taken this component from this function into a buffered image variable and now what I will do is write image I O dot and here I will write this is correct image variable first column and in the second I will make double quote and I will write png so my file type will be png format and then I will write new file and in the bracket yeah, I will copy my string variable name which is file name and I will paste it here ok so these are the two functions which I have made in order to save the first function in is to capture the image and the second function is to save it in the form of png now I will go to my design and I will go to my take pick button which I have created earlier and I will go to its event action action perform method once again I will try because it haven't gone there and in here what you will write is you will copy your function name called save image which I have made earlier I will show you 
this function which contains two parameters save screenshot function you will copy and once again you will go to your take pick method and you will paste it here and this close and in here you have to pass two parameters so first parameter will be your j component name